Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing something a little bit different today. This was actually a really requested video from the girls in my group that I run on Facebook. Um, up until, I guess, last week sometime, we were actually a dedicated Mimi Box Canada group. Um, there have been some serious changes in the way that uh, Mimi Box goes about their business. They have decided to forego basically international shipping. They have decided that they are only going to ship to the United States, to China, and to Korea. Um, we got an email the 30th of January um, that explained basically that as of February the 10th, 2015, they were ceasing shipping anywhere else but those three places. Um, this comes as a big shock to myself and to the other people who are dedicated uh, customers of Mimi Box. We did not see this coming by a long shot. Um, the company has grown by leaps and bounds since um, their inception in 2013. And I think that they were unprepared for the enormity of popularity that they were receiving from um, all over the world once they decided to pursue that. Um, they have made it difficult for those of us who were affiliates of the website to um, be paid out for our commissions. Um, I waited quite some time um, for something that I really wanted to buy with my commission. So I didn't pay out. I didn't request that. Um, we got emails um, about major changes to their affiliate program um, back uh, approximately the 5th of January. Um, they were going to be switching networks to um, a different website, to a different affiliate program. So they sent out these emails telling people, you know, you if you want to continue with this program to switch to this other company to sign up. Um, it was an ordeal for those of us who decided that it would be worth our time and energy to become affiliates of this new system. Um, at one point, I had my account suspended and I contacted the company and I basically had to um, give them just cause as to why I was worth um, continuing with the affiliate program. Um, I emailed Lauren who is the person who runs that side of things. Um, you know, she was telling me, you know, they'll, it, it's okay, keep doing it, don't worry about it, it's worth it. Well, I have tried to contact Mimi Box and Lauren three times now since this has happened, since they've decided to stop shipping to Canada. I have got no response. Um, it That's very unlike them. I usually do not have any issues with receiving correspondence back from the company. I'm disappointed because I wanted to make sure that you, the viewers, and the people who subscribe to this channel were as educated as I could make you in regards to this. They have decided not to provide any information besides what they have sent in these emails. Um, we got an email today, which is the 4th of February, um, explaining the withdrawal process that they would be going through. They had originally sent one saying that um, they would be completed um, in the beginning of February. I believe in the first two weeks of February. Um, the shipping deadline for anybody who is not in the United States, China, or Korea to purchase anything off of their website is now the 10th of February. This new email that we got 
in regards to the withdrawal program that they have started is that they won't be completed until the 18th of February. I find this absolutely ridiculous. They have known, I am sure, for quite some time that they would be ceasing shipping to other places than the three that I've mentioned before. And I find it disrespectful that they have put us through all of this nonsense, going through hoops for these people, when we are the ones, as customers, who have made sure that this company is a success. They are making it extremely complicated for those of us who would like to be paid out in cash. Um, they have decided because apparently many of us have requested that we be paid out in points, that that is what's going to happen. So now, um, as long as you have $1 commission, that will then add up to a point. If you wish after all this is said and done and you can no longer use your points because by the 18th of February, that will have been eight solid days past the shipping deadline for anybody outside of the US, China or Korea to purchase anything off the website. You can then go through a lengthy process of forms to fill out, to be um, compensated in money, in cash, through PayPal. Um, <laughs> I, I find this ridiculous because they are, they are being belligerent in my estimation. Um, they have made a mockery of the people who are international customers who have made sure that this company has been a roaring success. You guys and myself are being treated completely unfairly and have been kept in the dark this entire time. I have read a response from Lauren to another girl in another group who basically said that she was told to keep going to act as normal as possible, to make sure that she went along with what was going on, that she could not in any way, shape or form inform us that this was going to happen. When in fact, they knew long before these emails were sent out. And I personally think that is why they started doing this with the affiliate program and the way that the withdrawal system is now working. They have decided that we are not good enough for them. I, I am so angry and I am disappointed because I have been an advocate of this company from the start. I have bought tons of boxes and now they are basically saying, we don't want you anymore. And I for one think that there are going to be a lot of canceled um, orders and a lot of people demanding refunds off their products. And I don't blame you because I personally would rather not give them any more of my money or my time or my thought. But because this video was requested, I'm here and I'm trying to give you guys the most information that I can. Um, I am beyond words and it's it's sad but you know things happen we have to take it in stride um, nobody's perfect and I'm not asking this company to be perfect but I am simply wondering why you kept your customers in the dark why they decided to just let us go on as if everything was normal and all of a sudden, at some ungodly hour in the morning, send out these emails basically telling us, your money's no good here anymore. 
And I have heard from other sources that apparently they ceased shipping other places before and months later decided that it was a huge mistake. It would take a lot, and I do mean a lot, of persuading for me to go back to them. I will now be buying my products off Korea Depart, off Beauty Net Korea, off Tester Korea, off eBay, and off the people who are in my group who have things to sell. Because I am no longer going to support this company. This is insane. And I hope that when the time comes and they decide to come crawling back to us, that it takes you a second, that you have to think before you go back. Because this is not fair. Um, I would like to know your thoughts. If you're an international customer, like I am from Canada, or if you're from another country that they've decided to stop shipping, or if you're from a country that they're still shipping to, if you're from the US, if you're from Korea, if you're from China, I wanna know what you guys think about this. Do you guys think it's fair? Do you think that there is going to be limited product now, that you guys aren't going to get the whole range of things? that it's just going to be a US only shop, that the international items that were in, available on the website are no longer going to be there. What do you guys think of this new affiliate thing? Did you find it worth signing up? And the payouts, what are you guys gonna do? Are you guys gonna take the time and energy in the end, if you don't get the points, to spend, to go through all of this with your PayPal? And don't forget, that PayPal takes a percentage off the money when you receive it. They said that they're going to try and um, not allow that to happen with giving you a little bit more to cover those things, but they can't guarantee that. So if you guys have any thoughts on this, if you guys want to let me know what you think, Leave a comment in the comment section below and I would love to hear from you guys. I will try and answer anything else that you guys have, questions, comments, anything like that. Um, don't forget to like this video, um, subscribe if you haven't already, and share it. Until next time, bye guys.